Hello guys, my name is Alessia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today we continue watching Young Sheldon season 1. So guys, what happened in the previous episode is that we just met all new characters, which is Sheldon, Missy, Georgie, their father and their mother. And it was so freaking cute. I adore Sheldon so much already. And then so far <laughs> by watching one episode, my favorite character is Missy. I already see that she's going to be my number one because she says what she wants to say and she does what she wants to do <laughs> and i love it so we see how the character is going to be developing and i'm just super excited for it so less talking guys let's get started heart poor little guy oh no one wants to sit with him can't sit with him come on mary when you were in high school would you have lunch with a nine-year-old yes i would have <laughs> well, there's something wrong. i'm gonna keep him company hey, hey, that's mary, true mary, right now the kids are just ignoring show what happens if he's sitting with his mommy? They could mistake me for a senior. <laughs> well, Classic like moms. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I look young, start. of course. Well, work itself out. But I mean, yeah, as long as they don't My bother him, I think it's good. I actually enjoyed being alone. Solitude allowed me to think about important things. Oh yeah, things. he's in his like universe, in his own world. <laughs> Just vibing. Just he doesn't need anyone. Things, like how many grapes my brother can fit in his mouth. <laughs> Jean-Paul Sartre said hell is other people. <laughs> That's humorous because it's true. My god, look at his baby. How come math is easy for Sheldon and hard for me? I don't know, honey, but you have your own gifts. Like what? Well, like... <laughs> You have very pretty hair. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, yeah, you Georgie, speaking facts, Mom. Would you do me a tiny little favor? Like what? Tomorrow at lunch, would you mind sitting with your brother? Don't do it, Georgie. Stay out of this. <laughs> I, it was your reputation really gonna go down. Life. Sorry, Mom. Can't do it. Why are you such a brat? Maybe I'm crying for attention. Aw. This isn't a joke, young lady. Yes, your brother may be smart, but he doesn't have a friend in the world. And I am sorry, but I am very worried. About oh, he's going to have so many friends when he's going to grow up. So relax. <laughs> he even going to have a wife. What did I do? You don't have any friends and she is beside herself. But I'm fine without friends. I don't know what to tell you, Sheldon. She's sad. Yeah, just You're moms. They out. just bothered about it and worried Science about you. fact, sisters are the worst. <laughs> when you're three foot ten and in high school, my god, he's little like what is it? Harrowing <laughs> experience. I, I forgot all the words like suitcase. So cute, but it's worth it when point B is the library. Home Aww. to the information, <laughs> so way, empty, the desk. classic. Hey, no, nothing fun today. I need to learn how to make a friend. Oh, honey. You having a hard time adjusting to high school? I'm having a hard time adjusting to Earth. Yeah, <laughs> you and me both. Sounds about right. Try this. It's been around a while, but it's still quite popular. Unlike me, who's just been around a while. Aw, does she also have no friends? Oh, friend. Poor Let's lady. Do it. Principle one. Don't no criticize, condemn, or complain. Is there even like a rule or something to make quiver. friends? I think it, it's supposed Thus to happen like naturally. The challenge of my young life. Hello, George. What? <laughs> I do admire your thick head of hair, George. Thanks. What's going on? Well, <laughs> Something's wrong. Well, I know Mom is concerned that I don't have any friends, so I'm determined to remedy the situation. Oh. George. <laughs> George. Do you feel complimented when I say your name, George? The book says you should. George. I suppose. Kind of overdoing it a little. Sheldon. Well, thank you for your <laughs> criticism. It also says I should praise any improvements that you've made. Okay. okay. I'll get back to you. <laughs> I need to come up with something, George. George. Thanks. On the heels of Sheldon. that successful beta test, I decided to practice the Carnegie principles on someone my own age. Hello, Billy Spots. Oh, that's the hey, guy Sheldon. with the chicken. I am genuinely interested in you and would like to encourage you to talk about yourself, Billy Sparks. Thank you. <laughs> I thought he was a bully. <laughs> you have the floor. 
Thank you. Cool. Looking back, I would have had better luck making friends with the chickens. <laughs> Are you one of those special ad kids? My mom says I'm special. Would you like to be friends? I don't Aww. think so. Especially in high school when you see this makeup. tiny little baby, you don't want to ruin your reputation. So I feel like no one wants to be Greetings. his friend. One. As much as I detest that odd smelling cigarette, I do applaud your rule breaking bravado. <laughs> Is he gonna complain about it? What's yours? Hello, gentlemen. <laughs> Look at him, he's so tiny. They can or step on him. Kissing. Can you hear me? <laughs> 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. You missed 11 numbers. I don't need to be good at math. I have beautiful hair. That's, That's all that matters, really. <laughs> Did you look at the card inside? Why? That's just other people who checked out the book. It's a list of losers like you who can't find a friend. So? So they're desperate and you have Oh them my, made. yeah. Look at her. Well, well done, Missy. Smart, really smart. Now how is it that you can't count? She's good at other things, so all good. Is that something you're interested in? Not really, but Missy told me it makes you sad that I don't have any. Oh. Gotta sew that girl's mouth shut. <laughs> she well, loves gossips. Baby, you don't have to go to any trouble for me. But I like doing things for you. You're a nice lady. <laughs> but if the book's not working... It isn't. But I realized if I find the other people who checked out the book, they'd be looking for friends, too. That's really smart. Missy thought of it. You're kidding. I'm as surprised <laughs> as you are. She's full of surprises, Excuse so me, don't underestimate her. Sheldon, it's recess. Go outside, see what it's like. Are you by any <laughs> chance? Oh, <laughs> well, that was a long time ago. I just got out of a very difficult relationship. With a friend? Friend. <laughs> I gave that man three years of my life. And Aww. my innocence. <laughs> I don't know Poor what lady. that means. It means men are lying dogs only interested in one thing. Well, that's not the dictionary definition. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's all romance and flowers in the beginning. The list proved to be a double-edged sword. It turns out self-help books written in 1936 were only of interest to adults. Maybe you need to look for an upgraded version of this book. <laughs> Emotionally troubled adults. Child, go outside. Poor lady. Yes, that's my signature. Why do you ask? I'm seeking No, it's all the teachers. <laughs> I wasn't interested in friends. I took out that book to help me become school principal. Did it work? Are we sitting in the principal's office? <laughs> no. Well, if your goal is a long life, that chili cheeseburger is a step in the wrong direction. Food is all I have. <laughs> a burger is really good too. Adults. Can cheer you up you easily. Watch me eat? Get out of here. Everybody told me, Hubert, don't date someone from work. <laughs> Did I listen? No. Let me tell you something. It's she literally all the teachers. Oh, no students. Of course. Later, Mr. Given Show me any students who's principal. going to the library in Ms. high McElroy school. Became more <laughs> Is that any good? I'm afraid not. I failed to make a single friend. That sucks. I have a tough time making friends too. Aww. Part of You'll be friends. Oh, I read that book. It's excellent. Are you into rocketry? I started with water propulsion, worked my way up to solid fuel, then went back to water after I set our garage on fire. Nice. <laughs> that's it. Engine, but that's See, I told you. To it just happens naturally. You're just bonding over something. Well, good luck on your quest to find a friend. You what? Too. You can be friends. Come back, Sheldon. Come back. <laughs> if you haven't found one yet, I have good news. Hell. Yeah. Mom, what do you know about the drug Prozac? Not much. It's supposed to make people happier. Why? I was just thinking some of my teachers might benefit from it. <laughs> Speaking of, I made a friend today. Oh. Well, that's nice. But as I said, this isn't for me. It's for you. <laughs> Our little that's it. Let's it's celebrate. A Let's have a body. beer. Mom? Yes, honey? Can I come in? Of course. Pretty cool. 
I was wondering when I could continue my rocketry hobby. Uh, Sheldon, we've been through this. You can build them, you just can't launch them. But launching them is the fun part. Tell that to the family of squirrels who died in the fire. Okay, it was just something I was hoping to do with my new friend. Hang on. Ah, <laughs> that's yes. it. It's fine. <laughs> the ban is lifted. Mary? It's for his friend. He's got a friend. Besides, those could have been rats. Their bodies were so badly burned. <laughs> I thought we were being cool. Okay. I feel like Sheldon's gonna use this excuse hey, without understanding that he used it as an excuse to do stuff. Bye. Well, honey, um, that is what friends do. My mother asked me to ask you if you'd like to join us for dinner. Why? I was hoping you'd know. <laughs> Be ready. Everybody stay calm. <laughs> You need to be quiet. <laughs> oh, he's gonna get scared and run away. I'm just thinking, it's the the guy oh. Tam or oh, yeah, I think Tam Pam, something like this. Sheldon's friend from the past. It just hit me from the so, Big Bang Theory. Uh, Tam. Tam. Yeah, that's right. Vietnamese, sir. Sure. You want to spend a little time over there? Army. Cool. Your mom's name isn't Kim Lee, is it? No, sir. Good. <laughs> it's a small country. Mm. What did you do there, George? So Vietnam, like in Rambo. Yes. That's a cool movie. Yes. Are you in it? No. <laughs> oh my God. Why would you it, know I, this mom? I, I feel like it's gonna oh, be right. awkward, Tam, awkward, gonna awkward dinner. Okay, let's say Grace. Now, Tam, when I say Jesus, feel free to say the word Buddha in your head. I'm actually Catholic. Oh. Well, that's too bad. <laughs> thank you, God, for this food. They Poor Tam. It, and thank you so much for Sheldon's new friend. Amen. 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 Well, that looks about good. Family. I love to for the Texas. dinner. So, for many years, my mother and my sisters and I were very poor. Yeah, the, don't start an argument with the kid. <laughs> when he was released, we escaped on a small boat and spent many weeks at sea dodging Cambodian pirates until we reached Gosh, Thailand. That's horrible. Oh, I feel bad for to to the <laughs> There's a happy ending, huh? See, kids, when the going gets tough, America provides. It did, until the Ku Klux Klan burned our boat and chased us away. You gonna put a good spin on that one? Mm -hmm. So we came we to just stay quiet, and listen to his story, store. and then be like, I'm so Our sorry, Tam, that you had to go through this. Day. Well, that was depressing. Yeah, it is. Hello? Can I help you? Sorry to bother you, ma'am. FBI. We're looking for a Sheldon Lee Cooper. What? What did he George? do? <laughs> These gentlemen are with the FBI. They want to talk to Sheldon. What? <laughs> Uh, well, someone living at this address recently called a mining operation in Canada and tried to buy uranium. Okay, maybe it's not a mistake. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> I think they got the right him. address. He's just a little itty bitty thing. He, he's harmless. <laughs> <laughs> he's in the garage. That's not looking good. <laughs> Well, guys, what do we have today? So Sheldon met his new friend and it was Tam. I'm impressed that I actually remembered because I was like, oh my God, this guy looks, you know, like familiar. And who was Sheldon's friend when he was young? And I was like, oh my God. And it suddenly clicked. I was like, it's Tam. I just hope that they're actually going to show more of their friendship because, you know, in the Big Bang Theory, they said that there was like a beef because the children left to go to the university and do, you know, his physics stuff. And Tam just stayed in Texas. That's why they got like separated and Sheldon was upset over like so many years and Tam even didn't know <laughs> that Sheldon was upset and he was on his enemy list. So yeah, I just hope, fingers crossed, they're gonna show more of their like friendship. Maybe they're just gonna vibe together. I don't know, Tim looks so cute as well. Oh my God, it's just so cute that like how they young version you know from big bang theory sheldon and tam they, they just look so cute i can't <laughs> and oh my god the fbi i think we're gonna see more of it more of the police coming to sheldon's house because he just loved to get such a hard getting stuff <laughs> if it makes sense 
like you need to get uranium yeah i'm just gonna call what did he call uh not not nasa like whatever he called and, and fbi showed up so i feel like we're gonna see more of it because you'd be like oh my god i came up with this really good stuff and i need it <laughs> but you can't just go to the shop and buy it so i need to call somewhere so i can order it <laughs> But it's classic Sheldon, you know, again, didn't expect anything else. And yeah, oh god, that was so freaking cute episode. Also, we can see that his mom obviously going crazy about Sheldon. So yeah, that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel and share with your friends. And don't forget to stick kind to everyone and spread love. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys!